Hey guys, so convention season has officially begun and I'm so excited. I'm going to a few once upon a time conventions and that's a dog. So I'm going to a few once upon a time conventions and tomorrow I'm leaving to Barcelona for the first one, which is Storytelling Con. And the week after I'll be at Storybook UK3. So if you see me at any of those conventions, please come say hi and we can fangirl together. So since I'm very bad at packing and I always stress out that I'm gonna forget stuff, I thought of making a video on how to pack to prepare myself and to help you fangirls and fanboys out there. So this is for conventions that are longer than a day, so usually two days or three days, and where you actually have to travel and stay for a few nights. So if you're going to a convention for one day, you probably won't be needing that much stuff. Okay, so let's get right into it! So the first thing that you need to do is make a list of all the things you need. That way you're sure you won't forget anything. I made a checklist and divided it into sections like basics, clothing, toiletries, convention specials, and I also made a small to-do list. Okay, so before you can start packing, there are a few things that you need to do first. A very important thing if you go by plane is to check in online. If you forget to do this, you have to pay a lot, which I definitely do not recommend. Next thing you need to do is, if you're going to another country, for example England or America, make sure to exchange your money to their currency. Another very important thing is to print your tickets. Travel tickets, convention tickets, boarding pass, just all the tickets. Also, before you leave, make sure to charge all your devices so your battery won't die while you're traveling. Another thing that I often forget is to look for directions and print out maps so you won't get lost. And also check what the weather is going to be like so you know what to wear. Another important thing is to check if any of your documents are expired. If they are, fix it ASAP or you won't be able to travel. And last but not least, delete all unnecessary apps from your phone so you will have more space left. Okay, now that we've done that, we can go to the actual packing. Let's start with the clothes because they take up most of the space. So what you'll need is a few outfits depending on the season. Then you need some underwear, socks, bras, <laughs> if you're like me you can wear Disney bras, pajamas, sunglasses and maybe some jewellery. Now I forgot to add shoes to this, so definitely wear shoes and maybe take some extra ones if you have space left. Then let's go to the basics. And the sunglasses moved. Okay. Take a handbag with you where you can put most of the smaller things in. Then take a wallet, your ID or passport, <laughs> sorry I don't have a normal passport, boarding pass or other travel tickets, your phone with or without a cracked screen, charges for all the devices you're taking with you. Maybe take an extra thing to charge more devices at the same time, I don't know what it's called. Also take a plug adapter if you're going to a country with different sockets. I always put all the charges in a bag so I won't lose any of it. Also a portable charger might come in handy. And of course money, but you're gonna need more than that. An mp3 player and headphones or earphones. A camera, obviously I'm not gonna use that one, but I can't show mine now because I'm using it. And an extra SD card. If you have to take medication, don't forget that. Maybe put an alarm on your phone so you won't forget to take it when you're busy the whole day. Then a book to read on your way, or a Kindle. Some chewing gum or mints. Maybe some snacks or food. I often take pot noodles with me because you can easily make them and eat them in the hotel room. And then some tissues, lots of them. A pen and a notebook. Great, now that we've packed the basics and clothes, we can move to the toiletries. So what you'll need is a toothbrush and toothpaste. If you're wearing glasses or contacts, don't forget to take them and also the contact lens solution. Also your makeup bag, shampoo and conditioner, makeup remover, a hairbrush, hair ties, and if you're using any special products for your face, don't forget them. If you're one of the unlucky ones who gets their period on vacations, you'll be needing lady pads. The last thing is towels, but hotels usually have those, so you don't really need to carry them with you. Finally, we have come to the fun part, the convention specials. So the first is fandom shirts, depending on the convention you're going to, or just in general. If you're cosplaying, obviously don't forget your costume. The next thing is your tickets. If you're going to meet actors, take something with you to get signed. At some conventions they have special Nintendo DS events, so if you're into that, make sure to take yours, or you could just play on it on your way. Okay, so we're all packed and ready to go. Oh no. Oh, I'm breaking things. <laughs> well, almost. 
So I'm going with an airplane where I'm only allowed 10 kilograms of hand luggage, so I'm gonna have to size down everything a bit. I'm also only allowed 100 milliliters of liquids and I have to zip them in a bag. So if you're in the same situation, don't forget to do that or they might take it away. I'm not taking any shampoo or shower gel with me because hotels usually have these kind of bottles that you can use. Okay, so we're finally packed and ready to go. So the last tip for traveling is wear something comfortable. I promise you no one's gonna care about your outfit. Everyone is too tight anyway. Just wear something nice and comfy to have a nice travel experience. Okay, so that was it. Um, I hope it helped you in a way. And if you saw that I forgot to pack anything, please let me know because I'm leaving tomorrow and I don't want to forget anything important. So um, yeah, that was it. And I will see you guys soon. Nox. This is not how you pack, obviously. <laughs> this is for the aesthetic. Oops. <laughs> Summertime and the living is entertaining Ooh, Hands are running and the puppies are high